This is Our Lady of Guadalupe Catholic Church in Santa Ana. This parish has served the area since 1922. It is the only Catholic church out of 22 in Orange County where all the services are conducted only in Spanish. It is evening and time for a new kind of service for the Hispanic community it serves. Since March 2nd, it has been conducting screening classes like this one two nights a week and on Sunday afternoons for undocumented workers. The objective is to help them to understand and comply with the new immigration law, which promises a new life through amnesty and legalization. All verbal instructions and all written materials are in Spanish. It is part of a massive effort under the direction of the Catholic Charities of the Diocese of Orange to help with the enormous task of explaining the 56-page INS guidelines to them and helping them prepare for their legalization application and interview. Since early March, 600 undocumented applicants have received screening help here. Leticia Serrano, volunteer, worked with Francisco Lopez, the church deacon, in the lengthy explanation process. Similar efforts are going on in the church's 22 parishes in the county. Catholic Charities of Orange County will be the largest voluntary agency helping in preparing applications. Officials there estimate that 60,000 of Orange County's eligible 100,000 aliens will actually apply. Yet even with their maximum capacity, Catholic Charities people say they can process only about 10,000 in the one year allowed. The remainder must find other private services or smaller agencies to help. The undocumented applicant must show that he or she entered the United States prior to 1 January 1982 and has lived here continuously since then. Proof can be in such things as employment records, W-2 statements, income tax returns, utility bills, school or hospital records. For those that can't get help from voluntary groups in preparing applications, there are private immigration attorneys or notary public firms, but many of these are charging from $750 to $1,500 for simply helping to prepare applications. On top of these charges, the completed application must include fees charged by INS of $185 for adults and $50 for children, or a maximum of $420 per family. Overall costs could be as much as $1,000 to $2,000 per family, depending on how costly the preparation fees. After the applications are prepared, they can be mailed or taken to one of three Orange County INS processing offices to be opened in May. INS interviews are then scheduled for qualified applicants for final approval.